Yeah, yeah. It's your nigga IQ, man. Back on Dig, baby. Next on deck, we got the story of YNR Slugger T. I feel like I, I, his face looked familiar in the screenshot, but I don't know nothing about him. I promise you. <laughs> let's see what's up with. I know he's from Florida though. I think if I'm not, not mistaken, he was. He was. Let's see. Maybe Kodak. He was with. He was with somebody. Julio Foot. Somebody. Yeah. Uh, raps a little bit. He's pretty big in Jacksonville. Oh Slug yeah, my grandson. Slugger T. Yeah. yeah, he's big in Duval. Well, he's locked he's up right favorite. now. Sounds cool. Really? Yeah, because him and I, um, you know, they get on, they go after each other with words on their music. He's in jail because of a rap beef? Yeah. Literally, dude, because of music videos. Like, yeah. showing guns in the music video, so they're like, oh. Yeah. yeah. And the gang squad come to your house looking for your grandson. Over a video. Right. Alright. Man, I ain't gonna slave in that bit, man. You know what it is. Man, glad to see you, man. Everything been alright? How you mental feeling? Yeah. Shit, I'm feeling good. I'm trying to see what, what's going on out there. Why are my people flagging on my name, man? Fuck. Motherfucker, everybody asking, where Queso? Man, fuck that nigga, man. That nigga and this bitch getting took up and through that, man. I'm gonna beat that nigga ass already, man. That nigga yeah. got scared, man. <laughs> Yo, so today on Famous Criminals, we are talking what? about none other than Slugger T. And I've been noticing a theme in these last few requests. Whenever you see a gang and there's one white guy in it, you get curious. Like, who is this guy? <laughs> is he actually about that life? Who dropped him off? Does he take tennis <laughs> lessons? I mean, people are really intrigued by the outlier. And I tell you what, the wannabes are funny, but this kid is solid. He has been shot at, he's shot back, and he's currently in prison. So we got to be real easy on him. But let's start from the very beginning. Slugga was actually born in a crime family. His mother, Robin Colombo, or actually his grandmother, was part of the McDonald's monopoly scheme, and she had mob ties. And what? we could probably make a video of her. That's him. She's part of a set called Young and Reckless, or YNR. He beat which the is fuck out, dude. A bigger camp called KTA. The members of YNR used to play football together, and they gradually moved on to gangbanging. This is speculation, football but I banging. think he named himself Slugga because he can throw a punch. And this was him when he was like 13 or oh. 14. He dropped his first music video shortly after, and to be honest, his music isn't that bad. So Slugga T was at a party in Jacksonville with YNR Mookie. Members of the rival gang ATK would catch wind that Slugga and Mookie were at an open block party. The two camps would end up meeting and shooting at each other, leaving Mookie getting chased and Slugga shot back. Slugga would release music videos with Mookie sending shots at ATK. ATK member Queso would respond mocking Slugga for getting shot at. Slugga's response was, you tried to shoot me, but you missed. The incident they were referring to could have mm. been at the party, or it could have been something completely separate. This type of activity usually goes under the radar, and that's why most murders in Jacksonville go unsolved. Anyway, Slugga and his friend Lil Nine decided to roll through Queso's neighborhood, hoping to catch a body. Slugga would get a little bit nervous at the end and stop it live. The reason why I'm talking about this incident mm? is because the guy he was in the car with was Lil Nine. And his murder would be famously mocked in the song, Who I Smoke. Oh. So in early 2019, Slugga and five crazy. others were arrested for having guns in their music video. Slugga was only 17 at the time. He pleaded guilty to possession of a firearm by a juvenile delinquent, and he's still in jail to this day. He's apparently been releasing music in jail, and he even got into a fight. We don't really know when he's supposed to be released, but hopefully it's soon. So just a little quick story before I go. I uploaded the video you just saw, and it got a copyright claim. Initially, I thought it was because of the No Jumper clip from the beginning, so I uploaded all the clips to a dummy account to see which one triggered it, what? and it was actually the live stream of them rolling through Queso's neighborhood. The video was copywritten because of the music playing in the background, and the video was on mute, so I don't know how that happened. That's crazy. Anyway, peace out, guys. Is this him? It's like... Yeah, bang it up, murder twin, diss track. 
Consequent, responsible. That's the album single. Yeah, I mean, I'm listening. Tell them who I was featured on that baby, bro. Murder Twins, we got Pooh. Like Tiny said, when we dropping? Tiny said, when we dropping? Shit. I know. It's not, it's not the mistake. Yeah, the, yeah, the, the producer asking you. Shit, the tape drop on the 28th. Man, y'all fuck with it, man, on the 28th. Who is that on the phone with him? Everything. Okay, okay, okay. Um, damn. He's still locked up for a gun as a juvenile? That's good. There must be some other shit behind that. Or maybe he took the wrong deal. Or maybe they just railroaded him. That sounds kind of weird. I ain't gonna lie. Not even on his account. I'm just saying it just don't sound. Sound like it's some shit behind it. Like, I don't know. It's, it's, you know. Free uh wine on Slugger Tito, man. He's, he's, he seems like a wild boy. I ain't gonna lie. He seemed like he was comfortable in prison, you know what I'm saying? Or jail, I don't know if he went to prison yet, but or whatever, he's, he's incarcerated. Is he, he's like, I beat that nigga ass already. Like, that nigga was, I don't know. Um, Y'all let me know what you think about that, man. Shout out to whoever submitted that, too. Um, Till next time. Yeah. Yeah.